Project Cypress. This is generative AI designed to elevate your security operations center. It is meant to look at the current alerts that you are seeing within your environment. And there are three things that we want to do. One, we want to help your security operations center analysts better triage. Two, we want to give them more context around the threats. And three, we want to give them quick, responsive type activities that they can do. As you can see, there are a lot of alerts right here. We've got multiple campaigns. This complexity is where generative AI steps in. Sometimes you have so many things going on inside your organization, we could really use the help of generative AI. Okay, let's take a look at this. Let's enable Project Cypress right here. And as we enable this, you're going to see it really reduces all of these alerts into just a handful. In fact, we have seen a reduction of up to 10x by using generative AI. Now, from here, you can go in and see that we have combined these three campaigns because they all look alike. You can see the recurring threats, and you can see the MITRE attack framework mapped to each stage. Not only that, but you can also go into Project Cypress and ask it a question or a prompt. Hey, can you explain this campaign to me? What's going on? Well, we have seen a task scheduling event, command and control, data exfiltration, and this one looks like crypto wall. Okay, how did this attack happen? Well, the first thing was that we saw beaconing on dev VDI2. So what's the impact? Data exfiltration was the last step, and likely the data went out from the product mortgage app. All right, show me remediation steps. There are two possible outcomes. You can go offline or you can block the threat actor. Okay, let's stop command and control and data exfiltration. Cypress will immediately come up with a response that says, hey, here are the IDS signatures that you can deploy immediately. What would you like me to do? Yes, go ahead and deploy these to stop the exfiltration and stop the actual command and control. It immediately goes out, only taking a few seconds. The chosen policy has been applied, and then you can go to it and see it in action that the policy is being deployed and see actual preventative capabilities. So that is Project Cypress. You can ask questions and you can look at prompts, but the goal is to give you the ability to triage faster with the help of generative AI, give you more context instead of having to search and read, which is time consuming, we're compiling all this and we'll come back immediately. And then from that, we can provide remediation actions on the fly that say this is the best way to go about doing it. You can stop command and control. You can stop the exfiltration. Thank you.